there are like two security guards coming. That's crazy, they got two cops pulled up now. I am checking my Ulta dumpster and there's a couple of suit bags here. I'm gonna get gloves on to check them out, but there's this one and then it looks like this one here, which doesn't look like they actually souped it. Is that a perfume? Oh, there's a perfume. They didn't destroy it. It doesn't look like they really got this box too much. I do see some type of soup in here, but looks like it could be a pretty good one. Definitely gonna grab that, check it out. I'm gonna get some gloves and double check this one, but I do see a lot of like foundation and makeup poured out. Okay, I got my gloves on. This one, they really didn't soup at all. This one here, they got it pretty good. I'm still double checking it, but it looks like they destroyed mostly everything in here. I'm gonna double check for like perfumes or anything like that might be able to be saved. I just finished going through the box. Here's an overview. And then there's a ton of these steel eye pencils. I think there's also some lip liners, but there's a ton of those. And then over here, there's a bunch of MAC foundations, a couple things of skincare, drunk elephant. I don't know if they're full or empty. A couple of sample testers this perfume or it might be a cologne but this one is full and it still has the box and then some hair care some clinique stuff which are also full and then some more sprays and all of these spray cans actually work so they're not broken and they didn't pop the tops off so there's that one and then i think this one as well i'm checking my mall dumpster and i have no idea what store this is but there's a bunch of random stuff like backpacks there's some doormats here, makeup and eyelashes, balloons. I'm gonna try and figure out what, oh, here it is. It's Five Depot. Never heard of that store, but there's a ton of stuff. It goes all the way back here. I'm gonna hurry up and grab some stuff out. Security here is super strict. I already have some stuff in my trunk. I'm finding so much random stuff. There's like toys in here. There's even some Christmas stuff. I guess they're kind of getting rid of their stock. And there's a ton of these backpacks. There's some more down there as well. Oh my gosh, I'm checking the other side and there's so much more stuff. There's a little wallet and then it looks like this might be a speaker. There's a ton of these things. My camera will not focus, but I'm just gonna keep grabbing all of this out. Okay, I'm grabbing everything else out, but there are like two security guards coming. So let's see what happens. So you're gonna have to see TV. Yes, it means criminally trespass, it means you can't come up on the law anymore. Um, it's private property, and um, not only that, we can't have you recording on the mall property as well. So we're, we're going to have an uh, officer come up here and have all that done for you. Okay. So, I just got stopped, and they said that they're going to CT me so i can't come back here so let's see what happens i think they're gonna call the cops hi oh, crazy. I got yeah i do like youtube and tiktok i got so. you nothing wrong with what you're doing you're allowed to do that okay uh, i just don't know if they have an issue with it because it's their property like i said it's no no big issue all right so like i said they have every right to come and trespass you from here i guess they okay. broke you before um not a big issue. Okay. But it seems like they have an issue with at this point you will be coming to trespass so you're not allowed here for a year. Okay. After that, you're more than welcome to come back. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. Yeah, anywhere else you're fine. That was definitely my craziest experience getting caught by security. I can't believe they actually banned me from the mall, but I was able to get all of this stuff out before security caught me. I found a ton of these really cute penguin backpacks. There's a few of those bigger ones as well, but this whole box was full of stuff. I'm going to show you a little bit more detail, but it's all just really random. There's a ton of these cups, and then I found a bunch of these eyelashes, probably 30 or 40 pairs. More cups, there's some keychains in here, electronics and chargers. And I have no idea why they threw any of this away. It's all brand new, still in the package. I don't see anything wrong with any of it. I also found necklaces. These are tangled up, but I'm hoping I can untangle them if I just spend some time messing around with them. They are really cute. Also, some wallets in here, which are adorable. 
some more electronic items again i have no idea why they threw this away but it was so wasteful when i got caught there's still so much left in the dumpster but i'm still glad i stayed and got as much as i could i kind of expected security to come just because i was taking so long but i definitely never expected for them to actually ban me i am checking my tj maxx dumpster now and there's a bunch of stuff on top looks like there's pretty good stuff i can feel that that's in there there's also a purse which it's a calvin klein purse and this bag right here it's pretty heavy it's kind of falling out but it looks like it probably has some good stuff in here too so i'm just gonna grab this bag out and let's see what we can find and on the other side, there's a Brookstone eye mask and a plastic bin. Okay, I have everything I found. This stuff was loose, and then I have the bag here. I'm starting to go through it, and it looks like there's a ton of beauty items. These, oh, these are earrings. That is so cute. I don't see anything wrong with them, so I'll check those out. But there's also some candy. Those look like lollipops. A huge pack of eyelashes. And let's see, this, I have no idea what that is. Makeup eraser, oh, it must be like the makeup eraser kit. And just a bunch of random stuff. I think I'm just gonna pull it all out and I'll show you what I find. I pulled everything out and here's what I found. There's a ton of random stuff, like electronics. I have no idea what that is. Sponges and candy. There's also a ton of beauty stuff like that. There's a perfume. I think that's Dolce & Gabbana. And then a lot of this is still in the boxes. I haven't opened them up, but they're definitely inside. Looks like a bunch of clearance items. Eyelashes. These are so pretty. I didn't see anything wrong with them. Oops. Didn't see anything wrong with those. There's some baby stuff. There's this Calvin Klein purse, which it was a little bit damaged on the strap, but that's not too bad. And then the blow dryer back there. And then this is like a lotion set. And there's two mystery bags. That one says makeup. And then these feel like shoes. This first bag is a broken highlighter palette. And then the second bag looks like a pair of boots. And there's also this bag, which looks like it has some leaking makeup and skincare stuff. Hey guys, I'm at Bath & Body Works. And right as I started opening some bags, um, this was kind of buried in the back. So it looks like a bunch of broken candles. I don't know what scents they are. There's a mini one and then four full size candles. So I'm gonna take these and check the bags as well. And this bag, I just ripped this bag open and it looks like a bunch of Bath and Body Works stuff. It doesn't look like they destroyed it. So I'm gonna check it out. Okay, so I'm just pulling the lotions. Looks like some perfumes. Okay. I see, it just keeps going. There's so much in here. Some lotions, hand soap, some more. Brought a little bag with me so I can just chuck it in. Undestroyed product. Another lotion. And there's some more, it just keeps going. And it looks like some body washes. And here's everything I found. Starting out with the candles, I found four three wick candles. Three of them have broken glass, and then one of them is actually not broken, and then one mini candle. And then surprisingly, they did not actually destroy anything. So there's a couple of body washes. I believe both of these are men's body washes. And then there's a set of the Pure Wonder body spray and body wash. There's also a men's body spray here. And then there's some more body washes here. This one is still sealed, which is crazy. I have no idea why they threw it away. And then a couple of hand soaps, some lotions here. So I got pretty lucky they didn't destroy anything. Bath and Body Works usually goes crazy. If you guys made it till the end, leave a rose emoji down below and I'll catch you guys in the next video.